<laughs> we are back. This is, uh, you clicked on the video, you know, we're doing another newly try on haul. Essentially, if you missed the first one, I will leave the link above, below, all over the place so that you can get caught up. But newly is an online subscription service where you rent clothes, but instead of like a rent the runway where it's like for an event, this is for a full month. And if you subscribe, it's like 80 bucks, I want to say a month and you get six items. You can then after the month is up, you can either keep the items for another month, uh, send them all back and get brand new items, or you can purchase some of the items at a significantly discounted rate. Uh, so like I said, I did the mo first month of it, and I actually ended up, watch the video, you'll see the items that I chose. I ended up wearing some of those items like consistently throughout the month and I found it really fun. I was happy to send them back because I was ready for something new. And what I did notice is that I didn't buy any clothes last month. Is that right? Yeah, I didn't buy any clothes last month because I had new clothes and then I knew I had more new clothes coming this month. So I'm kind of liking it. And I'm excited because I now have new items in my closet, hanging in my closet that I'm ready to try on for you guys and with you guys and uh, wear throughout the month, hopefully, if they all fit. So uh, it came all like this to my front door. You can kind of like build your little closet online in the portal. I'll leave all the information below and a referral code. This is not sponsored. They just do like a user generated referral code. So if you want to get, I think it's $10, it might be $20 actually off your first month uh, of newly and you can stop the subscription anytime or pause your subscription. So you don't have to like commit two months and months of it. But if you want to try it, let you know. Um, so anyways, there's a closet on there and you can kind of throw the month like things uh, that you want to try eventually and then if they're available when it's your turn to pick out your new items you can kind of see it all there before you it comes to your front door in something like this which is really cool I like the packaging of it and then um, there's a return label inside that once you're done you place it on the front and then you send it off it's super easy I'm like really kind of into this so the one thing I will say um, is that I'm still trying to learn the brands and how I fit into the brands. As you guys all know, every brand of clothing, no sizes are the same. Everything fits differently. Certain brands run snugger, run longer, this and that. So I'm learning the brands on there. They don't have that many brands on there, but the brands that they do have, I really like. And so I'm slowly learning how those pieces fit and which of those brands fit me the best so that as I continue on, if I continue on, I can kind of figure this out better because just at a first glance of the items that I ended up getting, I have a feeling not everything's going to work. And that's the disappointing part because then they just kind of sit with you for a month and you can't wear them. But right off the bat, Oh, this has just been crawling up. Oh, hey, girl. Okay. So right off the bat, I'm wearing two of the pieces. And this shirt in particular, I know I will wear uh, all month long. So it was definitely uh, worth it for me. So let me step back and show you the outfit. I think this is so cute. I love this look. It's very fresh. Um, everything, all the items, and I'll show you when we kind of read about them. All the items are originally kind of expensive and things that I would never like spend the money on, like I would never justify spending this much on a blouse like this, but because they were, the quality is really nice and I feel really good in them. You know what I mean? Like I feel like, ah, an adult, in, but like a cute adult in them and uh, that's something that I kind of just been trying to find with my style and my wardrobe, um, but be able to do it at a sustainable price. So here it is. Um, these pants are a little bit tight on me. I made this mistake last time in getting the 24 petites. Everything is in petites, which is what I really like about this site. They also have things in plus size and regular and I think long in some sizes or in some of the clothes. So definitely check it out. There's lots of options in terms of sizing. So these pants in particular, um, they fit great in the waist but are just a little bit tight in my legs, which is my forever problem but I do feel like if I wore them they would kind of stretch out a little bit love the length of them they would look great with just some flats some sandals um, I will probably just wear these jeans even though they're a little bit tight and hope that they loosen up throughout the month um, and this top is just so cute love the color 
Love the bagginess of it, but it's not too baggy. Love the style. It's just uh, it's giving me like 70s, 60s chic, and I'm here for it. So let me just tell you about this. So yeah, okay, yes. <laughs> yes, I was thinking in my head. So both of these items are mauve, right? That's mauve, M-A-E-V-E. -E. And I never, I don't remember purchasing any clothes from them. And I think I'll tell you why this Blouse was originally retailed at $78, which is just a little bit higher of a price point than I would normally want to spend on a blouse. I got this in the extra, extra small petite because I figured it was going to be a little bit baggy, so I think I sized that right. And then these pants are the classic wide leg jeans in a 24 petite, originally retailed at $140. Now, if you wanted to purchase, I could purchase this only 11% off, $69.42, and I could purchase the pants for $75.59. God, that was a mouthful. Did you guys understand that? Coffee. The discounts on both of these items aren't significant enough for me to justify it, although I really do like this top a lot. So there you have it. This is the first outfit, and I definitely um, envision myself wearing this a lot this month, and I'm going to make sure of it. So um, let's go ahead and just jump into the next one, and then we'll chat about it. I'm feeling so chatty today, so I hope you're along for the ride. Okay. Okay. She is cute. She is cute, but I have a question. Oh my god, I love this dress. I actually had been eyeing this dress for a while when I was looking for something to wear to my brother's wedding. I thought about signing up for newly, but I was a little overwhelmed by the process of having to do six outfits, whatever. Now that I'm more comfortable with it, um, here this is. I will say, <clears throat> excuse me, I will say it's very short and I'm very short, so I don't know how anyone gets away with wearing this. I did read that in the reviews, um, and in the reviews it's great because they have user uh, photos and descriptions, and the users can disclose their size and what size they got in this, so it was very helpful. I should really start doing it on there because I found it to be so helpful. People did say that this dress was very short, but I was like, oh, maybe people are just being like super modest. No believe them it's very short to the point where i'm like can i actually wear this out or do i need to like wear shorts underneath i started kind of doing one of these things it might just be the material like maybe i can steam it out but let me know what you guys think i mean it would be great for like a pool type thing or a pool party or like a beach vacay or something and let me turn around like my butt is there so you know, I think I could pull it off, but it's definitely very short. I did get the petite, which now I'm thinking maybe I didn't need to get the petite in it. Um, but it fits so cute everywhere else. I'm loving the sleeves, and I really like this color. Let's see. This is the tiered lace tunic dress. I will leave the links to everything below. Um, the brand is Blue Tassel. I think this is a free people dress. I got this in the extra small petite and it fits great everywhere besides it being a little bit too short. Uh, it retailed at $160 and I could get this if I wanted to pay for it for $88. I mean, how cute would this look with like cowboy boots too? I really like this. I think I can pull this off. I'm just a little weary of the length. Maybe I would just do some bike shorts underneath just in case. So um, I'm curious to hear your thoughts. I feel like a little doll. I'm not mad about it. Move it on. Okay, I'm laughing at myself because I don't feel like myself in this. Like this is like the actual opposite of the last dress you saw. I feel like I look like um, I like a real housewife. <laughs> You know what I mean? Like, yes! Va, va, boom, boom. Um, wow. Okay, I, like, really want to like this, and I wanted to get a bunch of dresses that were kind of fun for the summer that I could dress up or dress down, um, and I love the idea of this. I don't know, what do you guys think? Maybe I should drop these a little bit. I put a strapless bra underneath, which I don't love outfits where you have to wear a strapless bra. I probably don't need to wear a bra. I don't know. This just isn't really doing it for me. I don't know. I feel like there's some weird stuff going on in here. Maybe with my hair up. I don't know. What do you guys say? I, it's really cute. It just doesn't really feel like me. Let me read about it. This is the Bias Slip Dress uh, Anthropology. Originally 120. They're selling it for 66, which is really good. Um, and I got this in the extra, extra small petite, which is the right size. 
Anthropology, to me, feels like it runs a little bit big. You know, I'm gonna have to look at it in the edit. Sometimes when I look back while I'm editing, I change my mind. Um, I just feel like, who am I? You know what I mean? <laughs> maybe there's a way for me to like play this down a little bit. Like maybe something like this with some flip-flops makes it a little less like, hey baby. Um, that was horrifying, I'm so sorry. Well, that looks kind of cute. Since I have it for a month, I guess I will try to find a day and a reason to wear it, because why not? It's not like it looks terrible on me. I just feel a little bit like out of my comfort zone, which is maybe good, and maybe why renting stuff is fun. Uh, but here you go. Curious to hear your thoughts. All right, let's hop into something that feels like it should be a little bit more my speed. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. This is bad. This is very, very, very bad. Oh, from like here up, it looks really cute. Um, from here down, <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm sorry. Excuse me. What? What is this? What is this? And why did I not read the reviews properly? Or why is this not disclosed in the reviews? This literally looks like, I kind of feel like I'm in Mamma Mia, like on Broadway. But like, a, I, you know what, not even on Broadway. I'm like a, a cruise ship version of, do you know what I mean? Or like um, some 70s thing. This, this is so bizarre. <laughs> I just feel like it's so fitted, which I guess if it was like black might work, but like with this print and the fit and then the flare, it is just not it. I am not even gonna try to wear this out. This one's just going to go back in that bag for the month, which is the shame of this game because like uh if you don't utilize all six items you're kind of like well uh like last month i didn't wear two of the pants so far we're doing good so this so far is the only item i won't be wearing which i guess isn't bad but like what kind of looks like like it looks like pajamas like a what it's bad it's bad let's read about it this is the ditzy print jumpsuit from the brand hutch didn't look like that on her extra small petite Originally $170, and they're offering it for $98.60, no thank you. I mean, I guess if I went up a size, it would be a little bit better, but then it would just like hang. I guess I needed to go up a size. Maybe that's it. But it's not like small. It's just like super, well, is it as bad as, it's bad, right? Yeah, no, no, it's bad. Okay. I have another item to try on. Looking at it, very bold print, but I decided to just go for it because again, it's just a rental. It's not forever, okay. Thank God, let's look at this. I just laughed at myself while looking at myself. Okay, bye. There's definitely a lot going on, but I think that we can work with this. I mean, I think I, I kind of love her. Do I love her? Are we ready for a safari? Um, there's a lot happening here. I gotta look and see what size I got because Thank God they have this tie on it, but without the tie, I mean, it is a big piece. She's a big piece. Um, but there are pockets in it, which, hello, love. And because of this, you can really go to town on the cinching. I don't know, I just really, oh wait, we could do one of those. I feel like there's room for growth here. Not literally, although, yeah, I guess literally I could just keep growing inside of this and it would fit forever. I wanna make this work and I think I can. There's a lot of material happening. Let me just see what I did here. Okay, this is another mauve. So we're doing good with mauve. Uh, Teresa mini shirt dress, extra small, originally retailed 158. They are offering this for 69.52, probably because there's so much fabric and everyone's like, what? Um, yeah, it looks so cute on her in the picture. It doesn't look so crazy. Now I'm just looking at pictures of people in it and they all look so cute. I almost feel like I know I ordered the extra small, but this doesn't seem like an extra small. Let me look, hold on. Yeah, she's the extra small petite. I don't know. I'm gonna play around with this though. I almost even feel like just as that house dress for the month. What a fancy expensive house dress for the month. Um, Oh, I just think it's so cute. Would you guys travel in this? We might be traveling in like, would this be like too extreme to wear in an airplane? Um, it's like so comfy and then maybe like a, a jean jacket over. 
See, it's cute when I like put my hands in the pocket, but I can't wear my hands in my pocket the whole time. Anyways, uh, that's it. I think I did okay this round. Again, if you didn't see the first month's video, check it out and let me know how you think I had compared. Uh, next time, I'm gonna be a little bit more diligent with looking at the sizes I've ordered in these last two months and making sure that the brands, like I kind of get a handle of them. But yeah, I, I think this is so fun and I've got some nice pieces that I'm definitely going to wear out uh, over the month. So I'm interested to hear your thoughts. I will leave all the links plus in a referral code below if you wanna use that. And um, yeah, I guess that's it. This is so fun. I love doing this with you guys. So thanks for sharing my day in my closet with me and uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.